Hi Pisces, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back and um, for new viewers welcome and I hope you will subscribe and hit the bell on all and also uh, if you would like to be notified uh, have a look at the video on how to give YouTube permission uh, in the settings as well as in YouTube as your mobile device Okay, this is your reading, and I'm using the Transparent Tarot and the Everyday Witches Tarot. Um, as we are into autumn, the Maybon fest uh, festivities, that means autumn, that's the Maybon Equinox, and uh, I am doing uh, a Witches series in English and in Dutch. The Dutch one will, uh, is coming a little bit later. Um, as I've got it very busy and uh, I th I think you will enjoy the new witches series with Georgina and Wendy but uh, Wendy is Dutch witch uh, Wiccan and Georgina is the English witch or Wiccan and we did have some laughs but it's really uh, it's really gripping because it, it has motivated us to set our goals what we want to reach with the uh, working with the healthy witch and the workplace and the spells okay so i hope you will enjoy it and have a look and see whether you're enjoying it there's uh, lots of great stuff coming also giveaways in the autumn uh, because of the pagan deck so uh, please keep um, uh, in in touch or up to date because you might just want to get a free gift okay um, we're going to start off with the first card and the first card that you have from the um, everyday which is the devil look at this man he's got his hands around the children and he doesn't want them them to move now the children can move because they've got free hands or the hands are free and obviously they are listening to him and she's even got red cheeks like if she's embarrassed or feels threatened well the devil means that there could be somebody that's bossy or like evil look at his face but somebody that's bossy and is trying to hold on to you or to control you I know children have to be led but you can't boss them whether you're grown up or whether you're a child nobody is allowed to boss or manipulate you in any way possible everybody is their own person and has their own free will so if this um, the devil also represents in the traditional tarot um, addictions or I think bad habits like burning the candle on both sides getting late to school or getting late to the job that is also a bad habit if you repeat it okay so if you if it isn't you Pisces that has a bad habit or an addiction then uh, in, if somebody else is manipulating you or um, bossing you then break free because um, it is no good um, to be manipulated like I said and of course uh, it can also mean that peop somebody is using you and you are their slave or their backbone because they don't want to make decisions or can't make decisions don't let anybody use you be your own person and break free with exception of children of course but this channel isn't for children so I'm talking to grown-ups make your own decisions and be free the devil also represents um, as it happens Capricorn so there might be a Capricorn um, as a friend or in your vicinity that could be using or abusing you so break free and tell them to go and seek um, professional help then we have the Queen of Cups and here she is 
um, holding on to a shell full of water and she's like if she's got feeding the fish look at the fish jumping and she's also pregnant in this deck that um, I think that tr the, the artist uh, or the author of the deck wanted to project that she's a motherly type a nurturing type she stands for passion and love nurturing caring and she's showing that in this picture so you might be meeting a Scorpio as the Queen of Cups represents Scorpio and this could be a very nurturing loving passionate sexy and sensual beautiful woman or lady <coughs> excuse me I'm losing my voice so the, but don't um, exclude uh, Cancer or Pisces this person can also be very intuitive as um, the element water also represents the moon the moon is Pisces so here you are you've got the water element here it mean also emotions like tears uh, so you might be highly sensitive uh, now especially with the changing of the zodiac sign on the 21st and actually we're going into Libra according to the astrology astrologers on the 22nd the 23rd <coughs> excuse me and so you might be highly perceptive you might be listening more to your intuition you might be getting new ideas and your psyche might be really up and running and action active because we've got the Sun here all right I'm coming to the transparent tarot in a minute because this week I'm showing you a third way a different way of using a traditional deck and a transparent tarot so you could be meeting somebody nurturing or you could be actually more sensitive and more nurturing yourself then we have the eight of wands look at the wands flying through the air I think you'll be having a very very busy time um, at the end of the week as um, the ones the eight of ones means it is not raining it is pouring full of uh, energy uh, it's very busy uh, you'll be getting news you might even be traveling this could be a holiday or could be for work but there's a lot of news coming and flying at you emails text messages telephone calls you name it and I think the news could also be some kind of recognition or nurturing news it could be about a job that you've applied for in care in the health sector or even in a, um, a sector where you need to be careful handle things uh, sen sensitive things uh, like uh, inviting people or making appointments like a receptionist you have to be polite and your intonation has to be correct so I think you might be even hearing about a job vacancy or that you've been taken on perhaps you've broken free from an old employer that was bossy and demanding and you wanted to take care uh, you wanted to take care of yourself and uh, apply for a new job or perhaps a lady might have offered you a job and is letting you know you've got the job because you've got the fourth card you've got the three of Pentacles and that is recognition perhaps this lady or employer this new employer is actually recognizing your qualities and your hard work because your resume stands out above anybody else's but this could also be recognition um, 
of how well uh, and how secure and caring you are and how sensitive you are okay beautiful you are no longer the apprentice you are beautiful and perfect okay you are fully grown and like a mother a grown up but a nurturing growing up now I'm going to go into the transparent tarot and then we're going to lay them on top of the traditional tarot first of all we've got the king of pentacles so you might be meeting um, a Taurus but don't exclude Virgo or Capricorn either the king of pentacles as you can see I've got this beautiful lavender paper um, and so you can see much better it's different than the white but you can see the pentacle in his hands and his and this could be in the past as he's looking in the past so perhaps you had more money in the past um, but it is this week so I think what you had in the past will also come back to the present on the 21st everything that you do will turn out wonderful and positive because the King of Pentacles is known to have the meanest touch like his wife she's got the green fingers he's got the gold fingers <laughs> so that's the way you can think of it as well so if you have made investments in the past they're going to turn out positive and they will bring you rediment the Sun is also lying next to it so yes uh, a confirmation that now you can afford a holiday or moving home perhaps to expand uh, your business or expand the family uh, something is growing it's like the rays of the Sun right the Sun also means fertility the time is good and fertile to plant the seeds and they will bring back the rediment like I said you've got the golden touch Wow you might be hearing of a birth um, or finding out you're pregnant if you are too mature you might be hearing of a birth this could be of a child or of a project like I said a new job in the healthcare beautiful you are in the spotlight the when a spotlight appears like the Sun the moon or the star it also not only gives light but it illuminates something so you might need more information so do the research if you are signing contracts read the small print okay um, with the Sun you could be going on holiday moving home as I said and you could also be moving up a notch in work or in a friendship a relationship a friendship might become a relationship Wow absolutely gorgeous you've been nurturing this friendship perhaps so that it can turn into a relationship because of the Queen of Cups she's nurturing she takes care okay beautiful card then we have the five of Pentacles the five of Pentacles is actually behind him so in this instance I will take the five of Pentacles that you might feel out of sorts and you're not quite in balance you might be out of balance because you are waiting for news perhaps news whether you can go on a journey uh, because we've got the two cards here that means journey holiday business trip or moving home perhaps you're waiting on uh, news that you can move home because you've got the home or you've got the mortgage etc etc <laughs> there might have been some niggly bits in the contract uh, for this new home or job for instance so you had to do some research and you got somebody 
to like the king of pentacles to do the research for you to see whether this would be a good home or this would be a good a good job for you or a good investment um, because in the traditional tarot we have the window of the church so that could mean institutions or a municipality you went to one of these uh, institutions and asked for help this could be a lawyer a bookkeeper uh, a doctor anybody like that because you do invest in your health as well so come out of your shell and get into action um, because the news is on its way and I think it's going to be good news because it means a new start as you have the death card the scythe is represented by the death or the death card is represented by the scythe and it's also a Scorpio okay so you might be starting or might be seeing your return on something in a Scorpio okay and you are no longer um, the apprentice like I said but you can also see it as you are no longer the caterpillar you are the butterfly wow magic a new beginning you're closing a face okay like the Sun the Sun also means um, you're in the spotlight and you're starting afresh because the time is fertile new beginnings okay you're just waiting for the go-ahead and I think that's why you might be out of balance beautiful now we're going to take it to an other level and this is the third way that I was talking about um, that uh, you can use these cards you can use these cards with any card at all whether it's Oracle Lenormand or Tarot but I'm using it with the witches tarot you were, might not be able to see it very clearly I'm trying my best because I love the way they interact now we've got the king of pentacles right and like I said break free you are your own person look at this the king of pentacles if you can see it and you just about can you can see the king of pentacles the head is here and his arm is out stretched so I am um, and it is just below the man so I think you are stretching out your arms and investing in something new or there could be um, a Virgo uh, Taurus or um, Capricorn actually offering you a rise because this means going up a next level a rise and somebody else is offering you look it's actually he's actually offering it to the little boy here but it could also be you okay it's just that the card is there so you can see that he's offering the boy a raise some perhaps uh, somebody else might be offering you something come to me and I'll pay you more you won't be a slave will respect you because we um, recognize your beautiful caring character Wow <coughs> now we're going to put the Sun on top of the Empress and you can see she's uh, got a shell with food or liquid in it and she's taking care now the Sun is shining on something that she's nurturing so what she's um, she's like receiving so the Sun is shining on her hands and on her belly her stomach so something positive is going to happen a new beginning this could be a pregnancy Wow it's right uh, by her chakra um, her, th her heart chakra her solar plex and her tummy the secretal chakra the secretal chakra means birth okay a new beginning 
and that is what the sun is also meaning or one of the uh, meanings of the sun so it's going to be positive okay now there we have the Virgo we have the Leo and we have the Scorpio in this reading and Capricorn as the devil is Capricorn and we've got the Queen uh, the Queen of uh, Cups which is Scorpio and we Scorpio is the most prominent one wool and of course um, Virgo um, the King of Pentacles is Taurus sorry <coughs> but don't exclude the other two but we've got the devil here that is also Capricorn so the earth sign and the water sign are very strong and I think that you are definitely standing with both feet on the ground like the King of Pentacles um, but you um, can keep control of your emotions you are stronger you're strong to walk away like he is he's standing and he's going that way when the devil is looking that way okay beautiful I hope you can see it right now we're going to put the five of pentacles on the eight of wands there you are now he's sitting here in the corner and the five of wands is above his head so he is waiting he's not seeing the five of wands yet um, uh, I think that's very good because he's not counting this is what I'm hearing he's not counting his eggs before they're hatched um, he's not looking at what he's got it's, it's it, with this uh, inter uh, connection it feels to me and this is what I'm hearing uh, look at what you have and look what you what is coming in be open to what is coming in don't uh, sit there and mope um, but uh, open yourself up open your heart chakra your solar plex um, to receive a love uh, material wealth because you've got the recognition awesome so don't sit there uh, all cooped up look his head is um, bending down so don't be said come out of your head okay because things are going to happen just like that boom 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 and look at this an ending and a new beginning so just put them properly so you can see the scythe you are cutting away from the instructors this is you you're looking towards your fee uh, future you're using your head blue pentacles money and red action and it's like if the scythe is cutting away through these people and separating you and you are collecting it's like the the bend of the scythe is collecting all your wisdom your material good wealth and your actions work wow you're cutting away from the past um, you're leaving the negativity behind you that devil now I've also got a card from the answer of the angels and I hope you like reading the cards this way abundance well you saw me shaking the cards um, I did not cheat so there you go it is talking to you abundance is coming in and you're going to get the news wow the sun is shining on you Pisces you are a water sign there could be new love I'm also pulling a romance card for anybody that wants to know news about love the romantic re romantic readings or romance readings will be out near near the end of September a new person has stirred your romantic feelings well um, I also 
belief that if you haven't, if if you are already hooked up and you're not moving, oh, um, and you're not looking for anybody new or a romance reading, the uh, general meaning uh, for the general reading would be new love. You have found uh, your way free from the old cutting away negativity you have a new uh, like the sun it means a new beginning a birth hearing of a birth this is a job so you found a new job or a new position that you like and that's what you're waiting on and it's going to bring you abundance because you've got recognition wow 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 i think it's magic magic is in the air okay pisces take care and please like and share and i hope to see you in the life have a great week ciao ciao